Today we're taking a look at the equalizer weight distribution system with four point sway control. Now weight distribution system creates a more stable ride for your tow vehicle and for your trailer. This unit features a two and five sixteenth inch hitch ball. It's included, has a gross towing weight capacity of 14,000 pounds, and it is designed for trailers that have a tongue weight of 1,000 to 1,400 pounds. It slides into a two inch by two inch trailer hitch receiver that's rated for use with weight distribution. Um, now with the weight distribution system, one of the main components is the spring bar. So adding spring bars to your towing setup really helps apply leverage, which transfers the load that is pushing down on the rear of your vehicle to all the axles on both your tow vehicle and your trailer, and that results in an even distribution of weight throughout. It results in a smooth ride, a level ride, as well as the ability to tow the maximum capacity of your hitch. Now this unit features integrated four-point sway control that's designed to work and stop trailer sway really before it ever begins or before it's felt by the driver or by those riding in the vehicle. The head right here creates two points of sway control using rotational friction. So the downward pressure placed on the hitch ball fights or battles the upward pressure created by the spring bars. So the upward force is placed on the spring bars on both sides of the system creating the rotational friction that forces your trailer to stay in line at all times. The other two points of sway control are created by the steel on steel friction that occurs when the spring bars slide within the L brackets that are mounted to the trailer tongue. Now this unique design makes the system compatible with surge type brake actuators. The spring bars are designed to flex for a controlled even ride. So these spring bars are constructed of a specialized steel for superior dexterity and spring. So this pliability is very important in minimizing trailer bounce. The brackets are a no drill clamp on bracket that can be adjusted along the trailer frame. They don't take up much space on the trailer frame. So this system is great for accommodating frame mounted items such as gas tanks, battery boxes, toolboxes, generators, and so on. When it comes to the head assembly, you can tilt it. Uh, desired tilt is achieved with a traditional spacer rivet and washer design. So you just add or remove washers from the spacer rivet to tilt the head up or down and fine tune the leverage on the entire system. That basically installs between the head assembly and the mount right here. Also on the bottom, we do have a set screw that can be tightened once you have it set the way you want it. And that's really going to help eliminate any rattle or play between the head assembly and the shank that's included with the kit. The steel has all been dipped, so it's a dipped steel construction. It's very durable and corrosion resistant. It comes with the snap-up lever to ease installation of the spring bars by reducing the amount of lifting required by your trailer jack. The product's made in the USA. The sway control brackets get positioned about 27 to 32 inches back from the center of your coupler along your trailer tongue or trailer frame. Uh, this will fit maximum trailer frame heights of up to six inches. So as you can see, it has a lot of holes on it, so it is completely adjustable to best fit your particular trailer frame. And again, the shank is included, as well as the pin and clip to secure it in your hitch. All the necessary hardware is included as well. The shank length from the center of the hitch pin hole to the center of the adjustment holes is about eight inches. From the center of the hitch pin hole to the center of the hitch ball is about 12 inches. The total height adjustment along the shank is seven and a half inches. So if you're using this in the rise position with the head assembly at the highest setting, it's going to give you a maximum rise of around seven inches. That's measured from the inside top edge of the receiver tube of your hitch to the top of the ball platform. If you have this in the drop position with the head assembly at the lowest setting, it's going to give you a maximum drop of around three inches. And then the holes on the unit are separated on center by an inch and a quarter. So that's your incremental height adjustment. Again, the product's made in the USA and it is covered with a limited lifetime warranty. That's going to do it for today's look at the equalizer weight distribution system with integrated four-point sway control.